morning to you all. My name is Jamuda, the IT rep for the student government. Over the past few weeks, we've had multiple instances of WhatsApp hacks and other miscellaneous activities happening over the internet. And I'm here today with two of my friends, Alexa and Joy, to give you advice on how you can best protect yourself on the internet. Thank you, Kevin, for this chance to address African leaders. Bonjour, everybody. My name is Alexa. I am really excited to speak to you today. Although I will share with you simple methods and habits which can help protect you from hijackers, please be mindful that there is no Silverstone solution to prevent it all from happening. But there is a lot we can do to reduce the risks. When someone hijacks your WhatsApp, it means they now have unlimited access to your personal chats, information, media and in some instances can also masquerade as you by deleting your chats, replying to your messages, committing crimes, and that's just the tip of the iceberg, of how harmful being hacked can be to one. Joey, we'll start us off with some of the possible solutions. Thank you Alexa. Kevin can you move to the next slide? Awesome. Rule number one. Never share your six-digit WhatsApp code with anyone, not your parents, not your best friend, and definitely not your sibling. No one will ever have a legitimate reason to ask for the code that WhatsApp sends you over SMS, so don't even think about sharing it. Rule number two. Log out from all computers that you see in the list under WhatsApp web. This will stop hackers from reading your chats further. This should be done every time you use WhatsApp web. Number three is the two-step verification. Kevin, you mind explaining this one? Absolutely. So first you open your WhatsApp settings, tap account, two-step verification, then you hit enable, after which you type your six-digit PIN, which you can remember. Awesome. Thank you, Kevin. Rule number four, be skeptical about links and attachments that you receive. If you're not sure about the source, don't use the link or open the attachment. Yeah, that actually reminds me of my jingle. Click clever, click smart. Do not just click on anything guys. Thanks Alexa. You all heard it. Click clever, and click smart. Moving to number 5. Back up your messages frequently. If possible, choose daily so that in case something happens, you won't lose a lot of data. You do not want to lose all your captured moments at ALA. You can't retake them, so keep them back top. Kevin can you take over? Thank you Alexa. Number 6. You want to always update your WhatsApp and phone regularly, and then to wrap it up, Get yourself a decent antivirus software and keep it running. Read app permissions before installing them, because at times you might even allow them to read your data without realizing. And then last but not least, do not just share random links to people without verifying them, because at times you're the one who gets your meds in trouble. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you all.